Today, DJI have released the Neo, their new small vlogging stroke FPV follow me drone. Now, I don't have one, although I have ordered one and it'll be here tomorrow. But what is also interesting with this release is that there's also a new firmware update for the DJI Goggles 3 that not only adds support for the Neo, but it also, as DJI say, fixes some known issues. Now, a few days ago, I released a video talking about the issues some users are facing on the Goggles 3 in combination with the O3e unit, that issue predominantly being people randomly losing their signal in flight, and that signal not returning until you either disarm the aircraft or some people even have to reboot. There are also other reports of issues of people getting signal issues, breakup, stuttering, but the main issue that is being said is this just random loss of connection. And whilst DJI have not said that they have fixed it, there is new firmware. And my advice to you is if you are having this issue, get this firmware updated on your goggles and try it out. And please do let us know what you find in the comment section. Unfortunately, DJI are one of the worst companies that I know for not telling us what they actually fix in their firmware updates. They always say things like fix some known issues, fix some bugs. So unfortunately, as a community, we are left in the position of not knowing what they've done, especially in a situation when we have a known issue like I've spoken about, and yet we're sitting here wondering what the situation is. So if you're having this issue, my advice to you is update your goggles via Assistant 2 for consumer drones. When you've done that, do make sure that you do a full reset on your goggles after the update. You can do that from the menu and then rebind your O3E unit to the goggles just to be sure and then try it and let me know how you get on. Let me know if you're still having issues. Now, today, there is only a firmware update for the Goggles 3 as well as the FPV Remote Version 3. There is no new firmware for the O3E unit to say they fixed any bugs. It still isn't actually clear if the issue is with the Goggles or the O3 firmware, but right now, all we can do is try updating the firmware on the Goggles because that is literally all we have. Now, as I've said, I will be getting my Neo tomorrow. I may even do an unboxing and testing live stream. We might even tear it down as well. So if you're interested in seeing that, please make sure you are subscribed. Watch out for the live stream. And that's it for me on this one. Let me know if you get it. Update. Test it. Tell me if they fixed it. And then hopefully, if we know they fixed it, we can at least get on with our lives and stop having to worry about the issues, as I've said in the previous video. Anyway, that's it from me. Stay safe. I will speak to you soon.